We're really gonna get me did up. Should I wash my face? I am kind of a dirty rat at home. We got this. This is when I end up making it like fucking shit again. Let me just laugh. Okay, I think I'm ready. I'm ready. Hey there, queens. This is my best friend Abby, who's come to visit me for the weekend. I haven't seen you since July. No, that's actually been mad. since July. That's so and um, it is. But we were having a um, like just a chill out session. I'm being really camp right now um, because we we're watching RuPaul's Drag Race, and oh my god, that is pretty bright. I'm gonna keep. I'm gonna keep these like at a low sassy angle. <laughs> No, actually that one just looks creepy. But yeah, <clears throat> we were watching RuPaul's Drag Race and we got inspired and we thought because I am like your gay best friend, yeah. I was I was speaking like when I go through my transition, I'd love to do drag. I was mm. saying that because fucking makeup and dresses. So many people are gonna comment down below, you're actually a woman because you like makeup. <laughs> Satanic Trigger. subscriber triggered voice. Okay. okay, well, we are going to do my get me did. Just, I'm gonna just be to sure. note, this isn't a drag look before I start getting insulted. Like, you don't know how to do drag. Yeah, this is your a shit. Drag look. We don't This is know. just makeup. This, this is, is just, just makeup. Fun. And the, but the reason why we were inspired to do makeup in general is because we were we were like, oh no, you don't know how to do makeup, and we were just we were being sassy and judging yeah. the like. Mm, this is probably gonna sound yeah. like shit anyway. <laughs> no, um, no, yeah, no, we're not we're not tooting our own horn at all. Um, even though hashtag makeup course that you did. Yeah, technically, I made makeup technically, artists. you kind of like didn't quite get all of it. But we might speak. I'm kidding. You got I the did, makeup part. I did have a makeup part. You didn't get the like. Was it the vag shaving part? Oh my god. <laughs> you okay. didn't get. You know the waxing. No. I you didn't, didn't get that one. No. Because you couldn't get but, someone but in. I'm a qualified. I offered, but artist. you were like, I don't think it would. But it would Thank look you. good. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. I, I offered for you to shave me. <laughs> As part of your course, so you were like, <laughs> you were like, no, I don't think people would want to see it. But it's fine. I'm not insulted. <laughs> okay, all of this for me. Yeah, yeah. Um, but most of it's gonna stay in. <laughs> I was speaking. I got a message and a fan art, which I will pull up on screen here, from this amazing um, trans woman in in the nation. In the um, the Madudes, because I call them Madudes whenever I start a video, I'm like, hey, the Madudes, but I didn't start this video with that, technically. <gasps> Shook. Did you pour something on this? Yes, okay. I was. This is like, <laughs> I didn't pee on my own shirt. Okay, right. <laughs> Abby is wearing my shirt. That, that I is fucking <laughs> this. <laughs> no, that I think that may be sweat. <laughs> no, I dribble. No, I dribble. <laughs> That's your dribble. <laughs> this sounds like fucking urine, guys. <laughs> but That's you guys know. <laughs> I feel like triggered to touch you now. I'm um, one of the amazing people of the nation. <laughs> just wiping me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> one of the <laughs> amazing. <laughs> One of the amazing people of the channel, one of the amazing community people, sent a fan out which I put up and I will re-put it up since we're first thing up. I was like, is there any video you want me to do for you? Because it is, um, it is like, fan art was so good and I was like, is there a video you want me to do? Well, I'll, I'll specify a video for you. And um, I don't know if I want to drop the name because I don't know if they're out as a trans woman yet. I'd never want to out someone as a trans woman, but you know who you are if you're watching. Um, because one of the things we discussed was originally we discussed doing a video where I compiled fan art, but I'm, <laughs> I'm not that amazing yet. So I only get like, you know, fewer fan arts, but all the ones I get are amazing. So we were speaking, we thought another one that would be cool is um, to do a makeup video where I can show people in the trans community, um, trans women who are starting out and they have no clue what makeup even is. Because I mean, I've done makeup before. Mm -hmm. I used to love doing makeup. I still do. I just don't have any makeup. <laughs> yeah, Dubai, so <laughs> Christmas. I'm um, just show some trans women in the community who have no clue. I mean, if you aren't taught as a kid how to do makeup or you don't practice and you come out as trans, you're like, 
well, I need to know how to Pretty do strange, it, yeah. and you don't want to ask people, sometimes it's hard, well, you go online and you come to weird videos of people like me and, and my best friend doing makeup. So. Yay! <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going out tomorrow night, so we may film some of that as well, our looks yeah. tomorrow. Um, we'll do some like really edgy, like Vogue, like contour. <laughs> okay, um, but yeah, hopefully you enjoy this weird kind of makeup tutorial. It's just showing a few little tips and tricks. I'm doing the eyeshadow, you're doing the actual the face because yeah. I cannot. My eyebrows, however, I don't know if I want you to pluck them. I'm not going to pluck them. I will. I will try to shake them. Yeah, I'll try and shake they're them. They're out of hand. I mean, possible. look at that. They're out of hand. Well, at least you don't have one eyebrow. Wait, do I have? What is that? That's beautiful. I said. We said it. I kind of do. <laughs> you can pluck that. I kind of do. You can pluck that. No, it's fine. I think we. I need sort. you to pluck it. No, but this needs to be realistic, doesn't it? Does that be? No, like, a realistic look on you. I feel like I'm going to change okay. you're just trying but to I do need to enhance you. I don't have any pluck. I'm enhancing you. Do you have any pluckers with you? No, I think so. <laughs> Let's actually okay. get into this because we've rambled on so for this too is long. A very, I'm starting, okay? This is a really important <laughs> part of um, your makeup routine, so we're just going to. That shirt. Yeah. <laughs> I thought that pink was your colour, so. Pink is definitely my colour, darling. Okay, and I always start off by moisturising. It's literally just like an essential hydrating moisturiser. <laughs> um, you can literally pick them up for like one or two pounds or whatever from like Superdrug. But it's like really good to start off your base, hold your makeup properly. So, you can, I don't know, you can use like a sponge or whatever, but I trust your face sort of. So, I'm just gonna go around. My face just... got pretty sh shitty since you last saw me. You look fabulous. This should be my everyday look. Should I should go into college yeah. right now. I'm gonna buy some of this. Okay. Also, yeah, if you wanna buy these. <laughs> Right, Primark do a pack of six of them for one pound fifty. So treat yourself Shit. this weekend. I'm serious. I didn't know you were skilled. You should be a fucking beauty guru of makeup stand. <laughs> Stop talking. She's ruining my makeup look. You she. If this sounds like shit, it's, it's oh I she do. Triggered. Everyone's gonna hate me. <laughs> Shit, no, sorry. I hate myself. Sorry. I mean, I am a she for today. Though. Yeah. A Smashbox primer. Again, if this were actually focus. Oh, yes. Um, it's a water primer, so it just holds your makeup properly and also give you kind of a wet look. Obviously, <laughs> I'm wet all the time, darling. There you go. So close your eyes and obviously don't breathe in because you'll inhale half of it and that'd be a waste. I'm just going to lightly spray. Honestly, lightly, your face needs it. <laughs> there you go. And then I just leave it to dry for a second just to A skin because we don't, there's nothing worse than sticking foundation on wet skin. It's not what we want. Fuck yes. <laughs> She's growing. <laughs> you. I'm growing. Hairs on her. His nose. Oh my eyes. <laughs> Actually, because my dad has a genetic thing where he grows a hair in the middle of his nose. Oh no. It's just. It's just. It's just. Okay, thank God, because I don't I want that. You. But every person in the generation, I think even my aunt has one. Big hair in the middle. Mm, right, love, so I'm going to start Debs. off with the Fit Me Maybelline. Matte Poreless um, foundation watches. in 115. Um, it's quite a light shade, but I might uh, mix it in with a darker shade as well. <laughs> but it's really good for like the coverage. So yeah. if you've got some spots or blemishes that you want to cover up, it's my really good. My cheeks is one of my problems. You guys can see here. A lot of people think I'm blushing a lot, but actually, it's I've had this since birth. Yeah, it's what like, it is. And then obviously I'm just gonna use my Morph brush, yeah. um, which is my blending brush. So. <laughs> so I've got my MAC Studio Fix Fluid. I can't remember what shade this is in. White Trash. MW22. I don't it's know what that It's the shade means. White Trash, guys. No, this is quite orange, actually. This is quite... Oh. Obviously, because if wow. you see my rubbish fake tan on my hand, they go, oh, look, that's great. It's quite a tanned colour. But and I'm quite a pale person. Gonna I know, but we're going for quite like a full coverage evening look. Yeah, go down the neck. Yeah, so I'm, I'm going to blend pale. further I'm, down. I am white trash. Is, should that be my drag name? White trash. White trash. <laughs> so we're going to literally make you orange. This kind of gives like a nice golden look, though, because it's kind of, it's not orangey. It's like... The pigments and it do give like a glow. What should my drag name be? Bone Garage. <laughs> I vote Bone <Pony> Garage. <laughs> vote in the comments down so below. So unoriginal though, isn't it? Like me saying that. My friends can see me right now <laughs> wasting <laughs> on your neck. It's not wasted. <laughs> on your neck. I don't need to put that much on my nose. 
Lift your head up. I can't blend. Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't blend. You're like a turkey. <laughs> Do you know I just can't. I just can't. No, it's fine. Um, I just. Okay, this is my Fit Me Maybelline um, concealer. So oh my god, you look awesome. You can buy it like with the foundation. It's really, really good for. Also, make sure one thing you get your shade. Um, it this just is not it your shade. To be Abby's just a bit more, you know. You so, have Italian blood, don't you? <laughs> I fucking wish. Um, <laughs> no. I'm, I'm just very tired. That's where your dad's like, I don't know. No, your dad looks kind of tired. My dad's from Birmingham. <laughs> <laughs> well, Probably why. me being accidentally. <laughs> okay, well done for that one. I've only known you for 16 years, you think your dad's Italian, <laughs> but don't worry about it. But if you, I don't know if you can see like from that far, but like I've just obviously applied it in like the areas that we need to like the under eye to cover up any dark circles and obviously blemishes as well, especially on the chin. Because I know like us being all Obviously, we're still teenagers. Uh, we do tend to blemish more on the chin, so covering those areas is like, really important. I'm just gonna pop over the lip as well as it blends. But you literally are very orange, and this is definitely not your skin, like your your match at all. I'm just doing it how I would. <laughs> That's fine. It's blended. We're gonna go for some cover. Remember when you put the rest of the face on it? We'll like look. So I'm not even gonna try and describe what this is. This is just a powder I bought quite a long time ago and it's like ruined <laughs> so you can't even read what's on the front because it's so old so yeah some sort of powder thing um what's this it is, called is it this is transparent powder transparent so powder. so what happens with this you can probably you find this online if you don't want to go into a store because i know a lot of trans women yeah. find it hard it's like i found it hard trying to when i first did it a shop at men's shops because mm -hmm. i was like People were looking at me, they were like, oh, you're just buying for like a, someone you're in a relationship with or a boyfriend. I'm like, no, it's me. So a lot of trans women find it hard going into makeup shops. Yeah. Um, because it's, you know, they don't want to. So you can get this kind of stuff online. Do you know any websites that are good? Just ordering home? Um, websites like Beauty Bay. They do a lot of like the big branded stuff as well. Um, so a lot of branded things uh, like the more palettes or Chanel, all that kind of stuff you can order online. Uh, Anastasia, things like that, they're, they're really good um, for delivery as well. But you can order like most drugstore things online anyway. Like I know Superdrug deliver now as well, yeah. as well as boots and things like that. So it's quite easy to, to get them. But this is just a translucent powder, so it's literally just clear. You pop it on and it will just conceal everything, just hold all your makeup and give you kind of more of a matte look. I'll put all those links down below <laughs> for those. I'm literally powdering you up because it's giving you, it's making you look less orange. It's making me look more white trash. Yeah, you're basically white trash. You're orange trash now. <laughs> orange trash. You're no longer white trash. You're I'm I'm an now. orange peeling trash. Also, I know this is really harsh to say, but I'm using this in, as an example. Um, because I didn't think about this. Just tell me how a second. You've got just again. If you've got moles or marks that you want to cover oh, I have, up. It's got a, a fucking hair in it and I don't know <laughs> But basically, yeah, if you want to get rid of things like, you know what I mean, like cover them up. Obviously My mum has the same one in the same place. So. The best thing to do is just obviously use a concealer stick, just in a circular motion. And then you can use a sponge, but I'm, I'm literally drawn to my brush because it just blends so well. Just pop it on and literally just dab it. I wouldn't I wouldn't go in circular motions because it, you won't get the coverage, but. And then I guess if it's still not, you just do another little you just deal with it again. if it's not no, got if it's, you just probably do another yeah you can, you can build it obviously um, it just depends how much coverage you want but um and luckily my cheeks kind of have a natural blush yeah but, if, uh, but it's sometimes too much yeah um. now with my nyx tame and frame eyebrow gel this is side. the shade this is just the brunette um so it's kind of like light browning and i've also got my studio brush angle brush i got this from uh super Rig for one pound 69 and it's literally the best brush i've ever used this should be very interesting it's because i fantastic. really enjoy your eyebrows <laughs> look at those bad boys this is going to be like the biggest challenge If you don't want to pluck them, because some people are really, some trans women, <laughs> some trans women are like really incognito, so they won't even pluck their eyebrows. You can do like a natural look and you can just follow the natural hairline. It's up to you if you want a fuller brow, you can just add. It's up to if you. you do want to pluck, it's probably best. Yeah, the only advice I give you about plucking is don't pluck above. So you can always go underneath and neaten up, but if you go above, you'll lose your arch, your natural arch, and to get that back is so difficult, like to grow back your I natural remember. arch. I remember, I'll show you, I'll try and show you guys photos. Oh my god, yeah. Um, I used to pluck I'll put them up right now, and I used to pluck literally all of my eyebrows off, I swear. Because that's what I thought was cool at the time. So you've got one eyebrow that's bigger than the other, which is really helpful for me. So if you can, sorry, if you just look here, 
I've kind of gone with like a natural just arch rounded shape I haven't gone anything too like intense but yeah it is quite difficult so obviously you've got quite big eyebrows I'm just following the natural line I'm not necessarily filling it all in because yeah. you would literally just look like basil brush or something right? <laughs> You would, so. Proper picture. <laughs> That's all proper. Stop moving your fucking mouth because I can't do it when you open your mouth. It's <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh my god, it's, I'm sorry, it's so impossible to do. Do you want me to try Look how good that other one is. Like it's really arched. It's just like that one is huge. So we're back. This is the finished eyebrow product. Obviously, we're working with my eyebrows, so there's not much we can do. It was a very difficult task. Because usually you'd have them a bit more shaped, like up. Oh yeah. I like mine. My, I don't mind mine thick. Now this is literally just a shitty palette I bought from Primark a very long time ago. As you can see, it's battered, and I don't know, but yeah. Um, I tend to use it because I quite like, quite like the colour and the fact that you've got different shades so you know what I mean? It runs me up, bitch. You've got for the darker skins there and then lighter all the way up so it's kind of, you can adapt it to other people's skin. What am I doing to your face? You know what I mean? Like, I can do it my own face at times but they don't touch anyone else's and it's like dog shite. What are you doing to my face? No, it's not bad, it's just very... I like it. Dumb, good. I'm, I'm up for it. I'm just blending that because I have some foundation. It's like a contour. Wait, is this contour? Yeah. Oh. It's bronzer. Is that a contour? Yeah, it's bronzer. Same contour as the same thing. Oh. I thought it was two different things. It is focused. <laughs> okay. Just to let you guys know, this is actually now a drag look, I've decided. <laughs> okay, a drag look. So it's quite intense. Um, quite full coverage. Quite like, boom. I like it. I like so, the over the top look. I'm just going to use my little brush just to pack it on because it will sit better. And this is kind of, it's quite nice, it's like a moonlight colour so it's kind of got a pinky shine to it. Just remember if you are actually um, trying to look like a normal woman, <laughs> don't do this. <laughs> just do okay. everything opposite. So just make sure that this, because I'm okay with this because I like the dramatic look. If you like the dramatic look, go for it. I mean there's nothing stopping you. Um, but um, much lighter than this. Um, in a year's time, I'm going to be forcing Abby to start her own makeup guru channel that she can do it on herself. But obviously I won't be um, doing makeup with this, this is because I was unprepared and if I, I think if I had like my proper resources and I had all the colours and things like that, I, it would have been able to, you know, suit see you. I don't even, I need to do this. It's not really awful, but I'm going to go with something, seeing as we've got a very tense look. I'm just a smack in some nice colours there on your eyes, alright? So this is my Morph 35OS palette. It's got some marks on it. A piece of Paris company. Oh my god, no. And this <laughs> is literally the prettiest palette you've ever seen. It's a bit mucky, sorry. Um, but they're all but shimmery I will come shades. I'll save it if you screw up my eyeshadow. Eyeshadow is, you know what I'm like with eyeshadow. I know, but I don't care. This is my look. <laughs> Because if you've done got quite an intense look, I feel like I don't want to use something a bit wishy-washy. I want to use like, quite an intense look. We color. want me to be slaying as a queen. I'm shook. I'm going to go around my mouth. Cut it out, please. I'm <laughs> sorry, should we put a thing in? I'm kidding. I would never put such a thing in. Shit, I'm getting... That's not bad. Don't even think that's bad. No, because... <laughs> Do you know what? If you're doing really fucking makeup, Can have I... your own fucking... <laughs> Video. Fine. It's just stop acting like a little drama queen because it's not you. It's me. No, it's not. I've become a new person. I am Miss T. We're doing a video for trans people. It's not a drag. Hard to look like fucking shit. Basically, this. I'm not telling you, hon. I just don't like your face. What are you doing? No, I'm done. I'm actually.